Hi guys, Ape here and welcome to a video on PC Building Simulator available now on uh, Epic Games for free and I think uh, Booba last stream asked me to do a video about this game so here it is I will continue my campaign because I have this game for a long time now and I'll show you around I guess Hey guys, Abe here. Check out Neba.com for cheap game keys. Link in the description. So here we are. Here we are. This is a uh, Timmy Shops or a uh, Team uh, Red's uh, Hot Repairs, and I believe this is your uncle shop. And uh, basically, by the storyline, it gives you the the place. So the first time you get the place is like this, it's very bright and uh, you know you have to turn on the lights otherwise it get kind of dark. But yeah, there will be some cool posters, some cool uh, second gen, uh, third gen ish, mm, maybe even first gen. That's a mobile CPU by the way, okay? And you can see the GTX uh, 470 super Deacon. <laughs> okay. A Zotac H55 Wi Fi motherboard and the new Western Diesel Velociraptor, guys. If you're all like me, you know that the Western Digital Velociraptor was a thing, okay? It was a really, really good hard drive. So, we have the shelf here with our inventory. It looks like I have a combination of, ne of a Nintendo NES and a Sega Genesis something. We have a Z97N Wi-Fi. <laughs> and yeah, this is our inventory. That means that everything we buy or we amount from a PC it will be in this shelf. And from here you can put sell on eBay too. Otherwise you can just press E and you open your inventory. But Let's dive in into the game. We have a table of casual things to do, which means that, that we have appointment for clients. For example, this guy wants this PC to be fixed, and this PC is now fixed, but it cannot boot to OS, that means operating system. You just turn it on, we see that it's good. Oh. Take it, put it, ready to be shipped. So we're gonna open our emails and look for that job. The job is gonna be somewhere down here because I skipped a few. Uh, this job is expired, so oh, fine. New PC is expired. Oh, this one here. Collect the money. We should be good. Okay, so let's see what we can do now. So I can show you what it, what the game feels like. I suggest you to highly avoid jobs that require you to recommend a spec for something because they take long, or uh, to run Cinebench or a uh, 3D Mark, I should say. So I will happily reject those uh, those things here. Friend on internet, PC, This one wants a new PC. We could do an entire PC with parts with lights, one color. We could do that. It's only 750. I, mean, I have to spend less than 750 with uh, hundred dollars on the build itself. So we could do that. And I'll show you actually how to do it. So we have in the whiteboard the build. The build you place, you take the post, -it, the post it, and place it on the desk, and that means that now this space is reserved only for this client. You can also buy more uh, desks, but I think it's kind of useless because you're only one guy, and you can just build a PC on on a bench and then move it and build another one. So we can go about buying stuff from the shop. We can buy, you know, cases. There are a lot of cases. 
And this is even my case, which is the S340 in white. This is my actual case right now. But you can buy a, a lot of cases. Also, you can check eBay once you level up enough, and every day there will be new offers. Means that this motherboard is gonna be used, but the client didn't say anything about using new parts. I think. Something in red in it. Because the cat's favorite color. Yeah, it doesn't say anything about using used parts, so. We can just use, you know, off the shelf component. I bought these pieces on uh, eBay. We call it eBay. And we can just pick up and build a PC with, it, with those. The price will be lower. So this case is actually a good one. It's not a bad one. As you can see, the price is cheap, 171. And if we look at the new one, I don't even know what this case is called actually. Storage works right now. I need to open PC parts. You can call it I have no idea, it doesn't say. Well, it's from MSI, so let's see. Yeah. This one costs 220 and we bought it for 171. Okay, this might be too expensive actually. <laughs> I will go over budget easily with that. Let's pick this one up, back up, here. Let's buy a new PC. Let's go by price. Uh, we don't want the stupid shit box here. This one is kind of hard to build inside. There is actually, this one can cost only $5 more. And it's very good. And it's white, which I like a lot. So we're gonna put this one in the cart. And then we think about the CPU and the motherboards. I would like to, I mean, I'm not a total scumbag, so I will not go Intel, because Intel chip stuff is really meh. We just got, we can just go a little bit more of power by going AMD. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna look for any board that has a M4 socket. And uh, we just need a few sticks of RAM, so I think, uh, Two titans, we can even go over budget a little bit and go with two kinda good kits that are not really good but they're cheap. Now we need a, a graphics card of any sort, which will be the 10, the cheapest, which is the 1030. I wish the price were good as now. We can go with uh, cheap storage, I like to give an SSD nowadays all day long. A power supply, we should be good with a 400 watt one, so we're gonna buy one of those. Cables, doesn't really matter. He wants some RGB lights, we need to remember that. But also we can buy RGB lights with the CPU cooling. So we can go over there and check anything with RGB, which this one will be RGB. And it will not fix, uh, oh no, it will fix the hour socket. That should be good. So we have a CPU, a motherboard, a graphics card, RAM, uh, PSU, we should be good. We can see that we are way under budget and we can do the delivery on the same day. So we can do that. Hopefully I got everything that I need. Here's our pile of delivery and this is the case for the client. So we're gonna pick it up, slap it in here, and we can start to uh, open it. I have upgrades, so I have basically auto cabling stuff that you might get once you start pulling a lot. So we need to install first thing first. I like to install the power supply for some reason. Second thing that I like to install is the power, uh, the motherboard actually. 
see the auto standoff is really OP in this game, otherwise you have to screw them yourself. In this game it's kind of loose the terminology of uh, where you put the ramps, so you just open the A1 slot and A2, but you can put it in the B2 and A2 for example, doesn't really matter, the game doesn't care that much. We're gonna check our CPU, slap it, RAM, slap it, thermal compound, or oh, thermal paste, as people call it. What is this one? Uh, why I can't? Oh, don't tell me that it doesn't fit. Ooh, it might do not fit. I believe it doesn't fit in this socket. Thank God I have another one. Uh, let's put this one. Uh, we're gonna cable everything later. Uh, GPU, we need to uns uh, unfit something. So we need to unscrew the, uh, the, the thingy, the case. Oh, it's only single slot. Okay, it's even better. You can slap part that. Okay, then we need storage. Where is the SSD that I bought? We need to place it kinda. Hmm, kinda up here, why not? Um, but I think we need anything else. We need the USB for later, and then we can start cabling stuff. So, for cable, we wanna go and purchase if we want new cables, but why not? I have some of those, so just plug everything in. GPU doesn't need the uh, power, auxiliary power, which is nice. The fan needs to be connected, and the power on button, which is uh, I actually have no idea what the power button is. But you don't wanna talk, you don't wanna buy Maybe it's in the front panel. Yeah, so I don't wanna be a friend, so I we're gonna want something hit that real and connect it. Maybe if I say the night, now the PC should boot, so we can actually right, put it on and go to the BIOS. Free performance by doing uh, RAM overclock, but we choose the RAM that slows speed, so yeah. Now we're gonna install the OS. And in the meantime, you can uh, finish the case. Just go in the case. Oh. Install. Oh yeah, we need to change the lighting color. So we need to get the lighting program. Everything requires a reboot, which is kind of awful. So you can just press P to power off and power on the PC back again. That counts as a reset. And we just take the lightings from the CPU cooler and we're just gonna slap it. So red is gonna be red, zero, zero, and apply. And that should be set for the specs for the PC. Now we can just click it, put it here, check the email. Oh, missing cable. Yeah, missing cable. Mm. Oh, the rear fan. I forgot about that. Look. Let's power it on again to see if it boots. It should. And should be good. Yep, we can collect the money. Five star review. And our total earning is 200 bucks. So be good. And that's basically the entire game. My piece is broken. Can you have a look for me? I have no idea what's wrong. I didn't realize there were clips in the RAM. And I got big well, the problem. It's a problem with the RAM. I mean, you smashed the name, yeah. It's getting a bit hot. It could be the dust? It could be, yes, it could be. Uh, do you like cable budding? I saw some great plastic red ones the other day. 
I hear guys use PC parts. Please do not do that. So this client would like to have all new parts and red cables. Which means that we have to go and click on the PC status and check for the RAM. He has a 4 GB stick and 240 megahertz. So we're gonna check for uh, 8 GB. 8 space. And then we're gonna search for that kit of RAM. We can do it by price of sending. There we go. That's the kit that he has. Probably has only one. Yeah, he has only one. And he likes red plastic cables, which I hope I have. Red plain plastic. Yeah, we do have them. But that's another job that we can take. And we need to clean the PC. Okay, for now we can turn off everything and go to home, basically. And tomorrow we'll have the parts. Wait, I didn't bought the RAM, did I? I don't think so. Let me double check my cart. <laughs> End of the day. Go to work. Grab the stuff. And grab the PC. Oh, this case is the H440. It's a great case. Oh my god, the dust is insane, bro. Let me turn on the lights and also the, the spooky lights. So we can we need to dust the PC first thing first. Should be good. We need to pop off the RAM stick that he forced in, and we slap a new one. And we check for boots, and then we change the cable color. PC boots fine, so we can shut it off and start unplugging every cable that we see. I feel like a plumber in this game. Okay, we can start by pulling this one, this one. There is an SSD back there too, I guess. Or on a drive. Oh, it's the fun switch. Oh yeah, the power cable. I'm missing the power button, which is up here, and that should be it. Everything should be. Oh no, I'm missing the cable here too. There you go. Oh, it's running hot the PC, so just in case we change the thermal compound too. We check for boots. Okay, shit good. I believe it's another five star. But yeah, this is basically the game guys. We have to do this uh, over and over and over. New parts available. Oh, we have the Patriot Viper SSD. Not a bad SSD. It's expired. There we go. 
should be five star. Oh, it's only four. They design you and fix my PC and they use brand new compart, which is always a good sign. Then I think I missed something. Fuck you client. Guys, I hope you enjoy. This is PCBD Simulator again free on uh, Epic Games. If you like the video leave a like and see you in the next one. Goodbye.